There's three things we need to do better about disaster recovery in Texas. First of all, rebuilding takes too long. It's taken us over six and a half years to get just past the halfway mark to recover from Hurricanes Ike and Dolly. That's too long for people to be out of their homes. The second is that it costs too much. Every dollar that we spend means that there's not another dollar to help another family who needs help. So if we can reduce the cost of housing, we can help more people be able to get back into their homes. And third, we don't do a very good job of learning lessons from previous disasters and end up reinventing disaster recovery programs all anew after every disaster. They're important lessons that can be learned in each disaster. And if we would prepare in advance, we could do things faster and we could do things less expensively. There are currently many, many different large and small barriers that keep families stranded in their house after a, a natural disaster, you know, up to a year, two years. Our idea was to change that system, um, change that system in a way to remove those barriers to get families back in their house within three to six months. We do that by, you know, using local uh, social service agencies, nonprofits, to do the outreach work. We use local contractors to build the homes, that way keeping the money here in the area. FEMA's temporary housing options actually cost more to install than what is spent to build a house today in the Rio Grande Valley. By approaching recovery with a temporary to permanent solution, you're providing immediate housing and you're building on that house, making a permanent solution. With this, we can both speed construction time and require less investment to build greater value. After a disaster, a lot of decisions have to be made. There are also a lot of resources that are coming into a community. The community is going to be better situated to take advantage of those resources if they know what they want to achieve during the recovery process. Planning can help communities to articulate their goals and, importantly, taking advantage of resources that come into a community after a disaster. My district has suffered through tropical storms and hurricanes. There's nothing more important than our Texas homes. When natural disaster strikes, it is the poor who suffer most. In 2009, we passed the necessary legislation to create a demonstration program to design a better solution to rebuild homes in the wake of disaster. We owe it to all Texans to put in place better ways to help our families get back in their homes after a disaster. We need to build on our proven Texas solution.